Christ of the Vedas a critical perspective in search of the truth the way and the life when we examine the world history and the jewish history we can notice that the jews were expecting a deliverer who would deliver them from all forms of bondages the jewish historian josephus flavius has recorded in his writings similarly the greeks expected the arrival of a national sage the father of greek philosophy socrates wrote to his disciple alcibiades wait for a national sage who will teach everyone how to behave in front of god and human beings during the reign of the roman emperor vespasian a, a roman historian wrote that the people of the east were overwhelmingly influenced by a belief that one who comes from the judean province will rule the world the same thought has been confirmed by the roman historian tacitus in his book historia the chinese philosopher who lived between 551 to 479 bc states the holy one has to come down from heaven he knows all things he will have power over earth and heaven it is in the context of this historical background i try to make a search for the ultimate truth in the hindu spiritual text which has its origin in the vedas they are rigveda yajurveda samaveda and atharveda the 10th mandala or part of the rigveda chapter 121 verse 10 says prajapati the lord of life lord of creatures and lord of creation this understanding of the creator made man to cry unto him as it is written in bruhat aranyaka upanishad part 1 chapter 3 verses 28 saying asato which means from untruth lead me to the truth from darkness lead me to light from death lead me to eternal life rigveda presents prajapati as the sacrificial victim or sacrificial purusha who removes the bondage of sin through his being sacrificed as a sacrifice in other words prajapati's self sacrifice becomes the source that has the power to deliver human beings from all forms of bondages of untruth darkness and death in the hindu religious tradition if the sacrifice offered to god has to be perfect the sacrificial victim must fulfill 10 characteristics these characteristics are attributed to prajapati who sacrificed himself as a sacrifice let us see these in 10 characteristics of the sacrificial victim as given in rigveda number 1 sacrificial purusha should be without blemish which means nishkalanga purusha number 2 the sacrificial purusha has to be separated from others by placing a bush of thorns number 3 the sacrificial purusha has to be rejected by his own people in itaraya brahmana chapter 2 verse 16 it is written that the sacrificial animal should be rejected by its father mother brother sisters and friends number 4 the yagna purusha has to suffer silently rigveda 5461 says like a horse i have yoked myself well knowing to the pole i seek neither release 
nor turning back number 5 the sacrificial purusha has to be tied to a post this pillar is called upastamba the sacrificial pillar which has now become a flag post number 6 the blood of the sacrificial purusha has to be shed bruhad aranyaka upanishad 3928 ट्री blood comes out of the sacrificial purusha who is cut number 7 the sacrificed animal's bones should not be broken in itaraya brahmana chapter 2 6 it says that the sacrifice separates the 26 ribs of the animal without breaking them number 8 the sacrificed purusha should return to life on its own number 9 the flesh of the sacrificed purusha be eaten by his saints in satpata brahmana 5112 we find that the prajapati gave himself up to them thus the sacrifice become theirs and indeed the sacrifice is the food of the gods which means saints number 10 the sacrifice is for all through that sacrifice the purusha prajapati offered everything that he had including the rig sama yajur vedas and the chandas sacred writings none of the religious text in the whole universe except the holy bible fulfills all these 10 characteristics of the sacrificial victim mentioned in the rig veda so anyone who makes a comparative study of the bible and the hindu scriptures is compelled to conclude that this purusha prajapati who is shown as a perfect sacrifice and the perfect sacrificial victim who has the power to deliver human beings from the bondages of untruth darkness and death is none other than jesus christ in whom all these 10 characteristics are fully fulfilled